what camera that you want to purchase which one you will choose hello guys so again today we have another vlog and today's vlog is about best camera for vlogging so if you are thinking to buy or to choose a camera for vlogging and if you want to start your vlogging career so this vlog is for you so again guys i will give you some um, cameras that good for vlogging so again guys stay tuned and check guys i will give you a number one camera that is good for vlogging uh, just stay tuned until uh, the end of the video then i will give you that uh, vlogging camera which is the best vlogging camera so again guys stay tuned and stay tuned and yeah and again guys so let's start the vlog so first uh yun, may notes na ako now uh regarding for the top uh, camera for vlogging so again guys disclaimer uh, this is only my opinion guys so, so again guys let's start the vlog so first guys you must think or you must consider before you buy a camera first camera type yes second lens or field of view that you will use uh, third the resolution or the how many megapixels uh, the sensor size yes it's very important also the monitor what kind of monitor of the camera and the microphone input is very important guys so okay so let's start from canon g7x mark 3 actually we don't have the canon g7x mark 3 but it's compact camera guys so it's a compact camera with a lens of 24 105 millimeter and with 20.1 megapixel camera uh megapixel with 4k 60 30p resolution guys so it's a 4k 30p size resolution with 3 inch touch panel 180 degree tilt for selfie so yeah if you want to take a video for uh, selfie or vlogging so this is one of the best uh, screen type that you can see yourself on the screen and of course the most important there is already a 3.5 3.5 uh, mic input so actually all the cameras from now it's already with a built-in uh, mic but it's a plus if you have a 3.5 jack input so at least you can use an external monitor so again guys the first camera is the canon g7x mark 3 and the price of the camera i will put on the description or in the um, in the screen of the monitor okay so the next camera for the category now is the osmo action so eto guys is an Ox Osmo Action. Uh, first, is an action camera, guys. So this is a good vlogging uh, camera, especially if you are into a sports vlogging, uh, like if you vlog some fishing or any types of sports. So one of the best vlogging camera that you can use is the Osmo Action. Because first, I want with a screen on the front. So. Instead, you will uh, use any uh, monitor or your mobile for your monitor. You have ready screen on the front. So, action. This is an action camera with a wide lens of 145 degrees, with a, a 2.8 aperture of lens, and you have 12 megapixel uh, for photo. And the sensor size is one is one to two third, and you have 4K 60p. So, for your video recording, you have already 4K 60. For, sorry 4k 60p and you have the front screen which is 1.4 inch so this is the 1 point inch uh, screen and at the back is 2.25 inch screen we had again there's no microphone input but you have you can purchase the adapter which is from uh, USB-C this is Sinova from DJI USB-C to uh, microphone 3.5 jack so at least you can use any third 
uh, party brand of uh, microphone. For example, I have here the Rode Video Micro. And so, for the next camera, guys, we have the DJI Osmo Pocket. So, ito, guys. So, this is the DJI Osmo Pocket. So, this is the first version, guys. Actually, it's, uh, we have, they launched already the second version, which is the DJI Osmo Pocket 2. So, again, this is uh, my third choice of the camera, good for vlogging because it's an action camera with a wide uh, field of view of 80 degrees and f2 for the lens aperture. You have 12 megapixel uh, resolution for photos and the sensor similar with the uh, Osmo Action guys. It's one by two thirds and you have 4k 60p similar again with the osmo action and with the 1.4 inch uh, of the monitor so yeah but if you want to view from your mobile then you can attach your mobile and it's included already with the adapter guys so it will be like this yeah so and the most important you can uh, avail or you can add yeah, additional microphone if you have this Osmo Pocket 3.5 adapter. It's a USB-C to 3.5 jack uh, adapter. So it's available in the DJI. Or we have also here. It's available in the market. What I mean. So again, guys. So this is my second, uh, my third uh, pick of uh, vlogging camera. It's the DJI Osmo Pocket. Okay. So next on our list is the. Canon M50. So, uh, guys, we have the Canon M50. So, actually, there's already Canon M50 Mark II. I think it's already announced or released in the market. But still, for me, the Canon M50, the first version, is a good one because, again, this is a, a mirrorless camera with interchangeable lens. So, yeah, you can buy any lens. And it's a 24 megapixel camera with APS-C crop sensors uh, uh, size of the sensor <laughs> with the 4K 24p 3.5 touchscreen LCD yeah, it's very important if you have the touchscreen LCD so at least you can defocus from your yeah and again with the microphone input guys 3.5 mic input jack so again this is one of the best uh, camera for vlogging because of this, the quality. I mean, the quality of and the specs of the video capable of the camera. And it's a DAF or DAF with a dual uh, axle, dual axis uh, uh, pixel. Yeah, so, and guys, this is my fourth choice of the best camera or, uh, from the, on the market. So again, the Canon M50. And for the next camera that I choose is the Sony said V1. So again guys, this is the Sony said V1. It's a compact camera with 2470 f1.8 to 2.8 lens aperture with 1 inch as a sensor, 20.1 uh, megapixel and with a 4K 30p resolution up with the S-Log S -Log 3 and again it's 3.0 inch uh, uh, tilt screen so again guys it's very yeah again if any camera that's with a tilt screen it's uh, very useful especially for vlogging yan, ganyan, di ba? so you do need to uh, to connect to your mobile or to buy an external monitor so again guys uh, article touch touchscreen with a 3.5 jack for your audio or for your microphone so yeah it's one of um, most important from the camera so and guys so i have a vlog uh, last actually this is uh, my previous vlog regarding the sony zv1 i test uh, with the default settings but uh, again i will make uh, more videos regarding the sony zv1 because i need to test also the st uh, stabilization of the camera and again guys for the next camera we have the canon 250d yeah so ito yung gamit ni palaboy ang 250d so it's a DSLR camera type guys with a crop, uh, sim, a crop sensor, APS-C uh, sensor size, interchangeable lens of course. Ayan, ginamitan ni Palaboy ng 1020. And we have a uh, 24.1 megapixel for photos and 4K 24 to 20, 24 and 25p 4K for the video resolution. And you have 
3.0 body angle guys oh, yeah, diba? so again it's a very big factor for plugging and you have a 3.5 mic input already guys on the side so, yeah. again 3.5 uh, uh, mic input and with the dual pixel uh, focus or dual pick out the DAF they call this DAF from the Canon the dual uh, autofocus pixel something Canon so again guys ayan it's a Canon 250D one of the best uh, ano, uh, for vlogging cameras that I choose guys so again the Canon 250D and the next is the Sony 6400 guys so my next pick because my next choice is the Sony 6400 again it's a mirrorless camera so yeah it's very light mirrorless camera interchangeable lens with APS-C crop sensor and 24.2 for the photos uh, megapixel with 4k uh, 30p resolution for video and 180 degrees vary angle so and uh, this is 180 degrees tilt screen so ganyan lang pero pwede nyo siyang iganyang up yan so at least kita nyo pa rin ang yung sarili for vlogging still you can see your uh, self for vlogging because 180 degrees uh, tilt screen yan di ba so with a 3.5 mic input again with a 3.5 mic input so eto siya so again my seventh uh, seven choice of the camera is the Sony 6400 it's a mirrorless compact and, and it's very light so again guys Sony 6400 and for the next camera guys we have the Canon 800D yeah, it's a DSLR camera and or the T7i 800D is very good also for vlogging it's a DSLR first it's a crap sensor size uh, APS-C and again it's a DSLR interchangeable lens and you have a 24.2 megapixel for photos and uh, also with a DAF or DF or the dual pixel for focusing so it means it's very fast for focus yes again with a full hd 60p it's not a 4k but it's okay full hd 60p still uh, very usable and very uh, clean uh, for youtube use and guys and the most important it's a tilt screen body angle sorry body angle tilt screen oh, so pwede mo maganyan so at least you can see your uh, you can see yourself on the frame uh, you can frame yourself guys ganyan ganyan ah, guys maganda pa rin siya guys diba? so it's a DSLR so it means the battery life of this is more for me it's more way better compared for the uh, mirrorless type which is for example uh, for the compact size of the battery compact cameras this is a way more better for compact but the size of course it's uh, the compact is for me it's more better if you have a compact at least APS-C that's a big uh, that's a big uh, factor for vlogging uh, okay guys for the next camera that we gonna that i choose is a full frame so i have two full frame camera compact but it's good for vlogging but it's a little bit more uh, expensive compared for the rest of the camera that i choose of course if you are already into a professional uh, type of vlogging if you want to improve your videos of your vlog then try to check these two cameras for your vlogging okay guys for the next uh, camera that i choose for vlogging is the uh, sony a7c so again guys this is the uh, camera that's good for vlogging because first uh, again it's a uh, uh, tilt body angle no it's a articulated touch screen LCD so yeah you again you can focus yourself you can see your frame on the LCD screen and first again it's a mirrorless camera so and I'm not mirrorless is new type of the camera and generation now so again mirrorless camera and it's a full frame guys so it's a full frame camera from Sony compact so this is the first compact uh, size but it's a full frame uh, sensor so again guys with a 24.2 megapixel uh, 
and uh, interchangeable lens again but you need to pair with the full frame lens also from Sony and again guys you have the 4k 30p full HD 120p and external mic input so and yeah, my external I think even the headphone jack for monitoring but here you have the mic okay from down we'll check USB yes also you have a monitoring headphone jack but again for blogging I think it's not uh, necessary but the most important you have a building uh, you have a microphone 3.5 jack uh, input and you have a very angle or touchscreen uh, LCD so it's a big factor guys and again it's a full frame camera uh, from Sony which is compact and mirrorless so again the Sony a7c and guys so the last camera that I choose is from the Canon, the Canon EOS RP. So again guys, the Canon EOS RP is a mirrorless camera from Canon Compact. It's not that big size, of course. Similar with the Canon EOS RP. If you check the body of the Canon EOS RP, it's way more bigger compared for this EOS RP. Sorry, R compared for the RP. So again guys, it's a full frame camera from Canon with 26.2 megapixel and 4K 24 and 25p with articulating touch screen LCD 3. LCD LCD yes. Again, it's a very big factor. It's very important that you have a uh, very, very articulated uh, touch screen. Touch screen, yeah. 3.4 3 uh, 3 inch uh, monitor. And with external microphone, 3.5 jack input. So yeah, this is the most important uh, um, specs for the camera when you buy uh, for vlogging. So again, I repeat, this is the most essential uh, things that you need to consider when you buy your camera for vlogging. For vlogging, mic input, LCD tilt, uh, tilt screen LCD and uh, camera type so it depends on the camera depends on your needs it depends on how you're gonna use the camera of course if you are uh, into a sports type of the vlogging uh, then you can go for the osmo action so it's one of the best and uh, it depends if you are travel vlogging uh, you can use your compact size of the camera we have the sony set v1 we have the canon e uh, canon uh, g7x mark 3 and yeah and more and again guys so the last camera that i select or i choose is the canon eos rp so that's it guys i have one camera that's best for everything so stay tuned and guys so back to the vlog so again the last camera that is good for vlogging is the mobile <laughs> yes guys is the mobile any kinds of mobile as long as you have the front camera and the back camera with a 3.5 jack or any uh, input that you can use on an external microphone then this is the best vlogging uh, camera that you can use if uh, if you are still beginner and if you want to uh, to start your youtube uh, career or your youtube channel then the mobile is the best camera that you can use for your vlogging so again guys because ah, mobile is every day in your already in your pocket so every day if you want if you think something that you can uh, be your content then uh, yeah it's ready to go and again it's pack of full of uh, specs As for example you have already your camera camera the front camera and you have an audio a built-in uh, mic on the mobile so again guys use your mobile for beginners so for if you want to start for your uh, vlogging career or for your youtube channel so uh, guys again and again guys so a disclaimer uh, this is only my opinion and this is my selection of the camera best camera that i can suggest yes i can suggest to you guys to check the specs before again before you want to decide uh, on which camera that you want to purchase or for start for vlogging there's a tons of review there uh, maybe this camera is suit for you or this type of camera is not suit for you so again guys make more research about the camera before you purchase a camera so again guys that's it for today uh, ayun, sana may napulot kayong uh, konting kalaman for the camera and again this is my selection of my camera 
that it's good for vlogging. So, ayan. Nasa sa inyo na yun, guys, kung, kung anong gusto nyo doon sa mga camera. So, again, guys, yun nga pala, shoutout ko lang si Inay De Reyes family. So, uh, give me this uh, content regarding uh, camera. So, I think he wa she want to upgrade his camera now. So, ayan. Ayan, Inay De Reyes and Mami Cheng Combo. Ayan, check this camera. Check all this camera, stand camera that I Ano, I choose on this vlog. So, again guys, again, flex time lang tayo. First, I want to flex my team, which is a Team Positive Vlogger. So, shout out to all the admin members of Team Positive. At syempre, kay Kulimo Piet, salaming maraming salamat ka. Noong Friday, ginawa niya akong uh, guest sa kanyang live stream. So, sh shout out, shout out. Maraming maraming salamat kay Kulimo Piet. And also, happy, happy, happy birthday kay Melvin Pomodora. So, yan, sir. Happy birthday, sir. Uh, enjoy your day dyan sa Pinas, sa family mo, siyempre yan, di ba? At uh, ayun, kay Palaboy na nagpahiram ng camera niya, sa kanya yung 250D. So, ayun nga guys, I think that's it for today. Thank you very much and mabuhay.